Tonight, Action News Jax has learned more than 300 local bank customers could have had their information compromised by a reported card skimming ring run by these two, a Romanian woman and her nephew. I'm John Bachman. And I'm Bridget Matter. And for Tanika Hughes, investigators say the pair compromised dozens of cards. Action News Jack's Ryan Nelson joins us live on the South Side. Ryan, this arrest was more than a month in the making. And Bridget, investigators logged hundreds of hours tracking the duo over the span of weeks. And police say they were spotted multiple times at this Atlantic self storage on the South Side. 35 year old Elena Matai and her nephew, 18 year old Plopsor Matai, are behind bars accused of running a Romanian skimming ring in our area. The Putnam County Sheriff's Office tells us more than 80 people in Putnam County and more than 300 in Jacksonville, Keystone Heights, Newberry, and Southeast Georgia were victimized. We spoke to people who say they're glad the two were arrested. I'm just glad they got caught. That's unfair. The arrest report says the scheme ran from April through June. Investigators say they tracked their moves for weeks as they went from banks to their home in Mandarin to this Atlantic storage on the south side. The report says they were even approached by investigators in a McDonald's parking lot on University near the storage. And investigators saw a red wig in plain view of their Dodge Ram and electronics in the back seat. And I'm so glad because really people like that are caught. So I'm glad. The report says about 73 cards belonging to multiple bank customers were compromised at Capital City Bank ATMs. The report says the bank reimbursed its customers about $46,000. The report also states 161 debit card numbers belonging to multiple bank customers were compromised at some SunTrust locations, and 138 of those were SunTrust customers. The report said SunTrust was at a loss of about $6,000. And coming up all new at 11, you'll hear from Action News Jack's law and safety expert Dale Carson as he explains why the bad guys are turning to this form of crime and why investigators have a tough time tracking them down. Reporting on the South Side, Ryan Nelson, Fox 30, Action News Jack.